This is where the Mississippi River starts, right here. This is the beginning of it. Yeah, little here. Right here in Minnesota. Or close to it. Must be 50 feet tall. What size is it? She's 38 feet high and 50 feet long. Visible from five miles away. You go right and then you go, it's on the right. Okay. Alright, we'll go right up here. I mean, we were here a couple of years ago, here at Painted Canyon, part of the Theodore Roosevelt National Park, but there weren't any bison here. We got some this time. We'll check it out. I'll keep my distance. Yeah, I'll keep my distance. I'm going to get a little closer, but not too close. <laughs> They're right here at the park. Painted Canyon, this is North Dakota, Western North Dakota. So you gotta be a little careful here. You're used to humans, but you don't want to get right up to them because they can't hurt you. And they will too. See, he's getting away from me. He didn't want me around him. There's like two bulls here. There's a bull there. So we're gonna take a look at the canyon. It's a little windy. No, excuse me, it's a lot windy. I may have to go get my microphone. It's real windy, but I'm gonna show you what I can. Now you can walk this canyon, there's trails all around here. We're not gonna do it, but it's, but you see how beautiful this is. If you remember, we visited this site two years ago. Not much has changed. It's about the same as you can see. The only difference is this time we got to see bison. Last time we couldn't see bison. They weren't here. It's very beautiful. You can see. Absolutely. I'm glad the wind calmed down enough to uh, get a little bit of good photography here. Okay, off we go. Okay, off to off to other adventures. We've been crossing the North Dakota Plains east to west all day and been fighting the wind all the way. I'm still fighting it, but it's been pushing that motor home all over the road. You gotta stay diligent. Here we are at Painted Canyon. We love the West. We're back in the wind again, and we're back in the West again. We've been fighting the wind on I-94 all the way across Dakota, North Dakota, from east to west, pushing that motor home all over the place. And so we stopped here at Painted Canyon. Well, that was fun. Oh, yeah. What a great day. Oh, look at him. He's it. rolling. Oh, man. Get up there. <laughs> look at him rolling. Four of them. Five of them. Oh, my God. He was just rolling into dirt. I think I got a little bit of that. Really beautiful. Okay, fellas. No. Take care. I think this is the kind of thing you can see a hundred times. <laughs> oh yeah. Right there. Thank 
you for doing my window. That oh was yeah. Really bad. <laughs> I did the window. We could only go halfway in the Theodore Roosevelt National Park. Clear. In the RV. So that's what we're going to do. Otherwise, gotta take the car off. Ooh, and this ought to work. Here we go. Steep incline here. That's rock. It's pretty good grade. It's hard to tell. So they were willing to let us drop the car off. Oh, yeah. Leave the RV and, and take the car. Yeah. That's pretty neat. That's nice of them. Yes, indeed. Pretty back in here. Oh, yeah. We just saw some bison at the uh, Painted Canyon Overlook. That was really neat. Oh boy. Where do we have to turn around? At Wind River. Wind Canyon, oh, you said Wind River, I don't know, I guess there'll be a sign. Because there's no place to turn around after that. Well, I don't even see it on here. Uh-oh. <laughs> not very busy. I think this is Friday, I'm not sure. Well, We turned around last time at Wind River. We'll see it. There's supposed to be a lot of buffalo around here. Bison. Keep your eyes open for bison, okay. you guys. It's a pretty day for this. Please. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I see some. See him. See him right in there. Yep. Prairie dogs. All out there. Bunch of them. Yeah, that one's not. Certainly not very busy, is it? Hey, look, buffalo up on the right here, or bison that is. On the right? Yeah, right behind that tree, that juniper tree there. Oh, wow. That's in the wild, y'all. Hey, buddy. Wild animals out here. Campground, picnic area. Can we go camp? I don't know. Go down and ask. Oh, up there. People said you hear wild animals all night down here. It's really great. See how this works. A lot of places have a kiosk. So you can pay right there at the uh, campground. We'll see what we have here. I see some camping over there. Maybe tent only. I only see tents. RV. Holdable water field. Isn't that great? Telephone booth. When was the last time you seen one of these? No. <laughs> Ain't got 
got no gas. <laughs> you got no gas. They've been all up in here. You can see Look at here, yeah. Buffalo chips. Okay, how many nights? Um, seven. Suits me. <laughs> I don't care. Well, we're here at Cleardale Roosevelt National Park, and we just found us a camping spot. Seven dollars a night. And they say that at night, it's incredible out here. You hear all kinds of animals out here. Certainly there's buffalo or bison. And uh, pretty neat. It's first come, first served. And they got pull-throughs. That's very rare, or at least in my experience. It's very rare to find that in national parks. All kinds of trails back through in here. I love it.